welcome to another lecture based on question and answer session regarding MRCS exam where are accessory is being not found so it is one of the direct question that the accessory is being not found that means the accessory is being is not present where of the position here there are the options the options are gonads tail of the pancreas greater momentum Spilino renal ligament and ureter. So we have to find out one of the options where the accessory is spleen is not located. So here this is the picture of a person thorax abdomen and part of the upper part of the thigh, and here we can see the accessory location of the spleen. First of all, we can see this is the position of the pancreatic tail. So accessory spleen may present the pancreatic tail and we know the spleen is uh, located normally at this place so uh, it may be dropped down in different part of the left side and then we can see the hilum of the main spleen that means the spleen mm, we know the spleen is formed by the different fat uh, initially is there uh, it was not a single one it is formed by very small uh, part and so the one part may be present at the main spleen main spleen hilum then the gastro splenic ligament it may be present in the gastro splenic ligament then spleno renal ligament it may be present in the spleno renal ligament the ligament which connects uh, the spleen with the kidney and this ligament um, it, uh, is connected to the spleen with the stomach then it may present at the greater momentum here and also pelvis so in the left side in all of the uh, any parts of the abdomen it may be there may be presence of this and spleen and at the same time it is uh, important that the spleen not a retroperitoneal organ so usually it present anterior to the peritoneum or within the uh, peritoneum or other ligaments so here this is the spleen anatomy and location of the accessory spleen again there uh, this is the splenic hilum here this is the splenic hilum then it may be present splenic vessels here we can see splenic vessel passes through this so it may be present here then splenocolic ligament that means spleen is attached to the colon this is the uh, left flexure of the colon so there may be present there may be present peri renal momentum here also be presented small bowel mesentery parasacral area ureteri adnexa and peritesticular region but here we can see in case of ureter there is no mention of the ureter because ureter is the retroperitoneal organ and it lies behind the uh, it lies uh, be, uh, in, in the posterior abdominal wall uh, through different uh, layers of the behind the different layers of the connective tissue here so the accessory spleen it not reaches in the ureter it may be present in the gonad tail of the pancreas greater momentum or spleenolenar renal ligament which is usually anterior to the different type of the ligament but ureter as it is the retroperitoneal organ the spleen usually not uh, penetrate the peritoneum and reach posteriorly to the peritoneum and here we can see details in short again that the hilum of the pancreas tail of the pancreas along the splenic vessel gastro splenic ligament spleno renal ligament wall of the stomach and small intestine greater momentum mesentery and gonads but not in the ureter or kidney or ureteric bladder because uh, they are a retroperitoneal organ and it is not possible for the spleen segment to uh, penetrate the, the different type of ligaments and momentum to reach in the retroperitoneal area thank you very much